Ladies and gents, NTV here with some more Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Last episode, we did a lot. We explored this part of the map. We got the very last secret seashell, which got us the level 2 sword. That's what I assume the L is for. And we also switched to the blue tunic. And we're also, also here in level 6, the Face Shrine. So, let's get a start with this dungeon. Um... Okay, got to avoid those. Ah. Okay, let's get in this corner here. Yep, this trick still works. This is how I deal with these floating floor tiles that attack you. Oh, okay, can't do anything here. Okay. And let's just head over to the other side then. Whoops. You know, I really hope the dungeon is in the shape of a smiley face. That would make me really happy. Oh, hello. Oh, that didn't work. Will arrows work? Okay, so you can't hold the button and then let go to shoot an arrow, like charging up a shot. That's a shame. Actually, I have an idea. Maybe this will work. It stuns them. Interesting. I'm just gonna do this then. Did I kill both of them? I'll take that. Okay, so... have one of two ways to go. Okay then, never mind. At least we got some money out of it. I'm perfectly fine with getting money. Um... Nope, oh, that's not a sword. Got so used to using the sword here. At least I killed the little... thing. Another one of these things. Um. Huh. Interesting. Let's lift up some of these, because maybe I'll get some hearts out of it. Okay, I got an arrow. Bombs. Okay, that's all fine and dandy, but... Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, can't go there. Never mind. Okay, it's all fine and dandy getting all those, but I kind of need hearts too. Wonder what those are. Those horse heads. Okay. Oh, can't do anything there because I don't have the stone beak. Okay then. So oh, I think I, I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Puzzle solving. I'm good at it. Really? Okay, whatever. Oh, let's take care of these fellas again. You little whiz robe. I think these are supposed to be whiz robes. They don't make the strange, weird creepy noise that they make in Wind Waker, and they don't look like toucans like they do in Wind Waker, so I can only assume that these are Wizrobes. Okay, so you can shoot me through there. Um... There, let's do that. I have ten arrows, this is probably gonna give me, like, five or something. Oh, ten! Nice! 
Okay, let's just take care of you, because I might get something out of it. Just like that. Oh, it's the map. It's the map, it's the map, it's the map, it's the map. Okay, it's not a smiley face, but it is a face. It's not a metal face, either. Um, ooh, hearts. I, I will actually take those. And I'll take the piece of power as well. So now I'm at quadruple power. And that's the stone beak. Okay. Pretty helpful. That's not helpful. Can't do anything here. Okay then, let's... Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Since I'm at full health... Perfect. Um... Just like that. Um... Okay. I think this is the way to the stone beak. So let's find out what the advice for the dungeon is. Into the space where the eyes have walls. Where the eyes have walls. Whatever that means. Um. Yeah, I really have no idea what that's supposed to mean. Okay, let's just solve this thing again. Did not mean to do that. Did not mean to kill the shy guy either, but... Whatever works. Give me refills. Oh, no longer at full health. Okay, so if this is anything like in the Candlelit Castle... Yep. Let's grab myself my full health so I can have my... my sword beams. Sword beams are always cool. No way, I don't need to worry about that. Okay then. This is the compass, so how many... How many treasure chests are in this dungeon, then? Yes, I know how it works. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, no, one, two, three, four, five... Yeah, seven. Okay, I can count. Also... Eh, I could always use more bombs. Hopefully that did something. Not really sure. Wrong button. Um, something about where the eyes have walls. Uh, I gotta do this again. Did not mean to set the bomb there, but whatever. This anti-fairy is gonna be annoying. Okay, so that's a key, which I can actually use to go over there. Okay. Also this music. Okay, so... Oh! I can do a thing here. 
Okay then. Wait, wait, wait. Full health. If I wasn't already obsessed with being at full health, I am now. That's not... Eh, whatever. Okay, let's do that so I can get out. Well, at least we can hear the... the music again. Because this is actually a pretty... interesting song. Shoot that. Ignore... that thing. I wonder. Um... Nope. Can't lift that up. I only have one more item spot to fill in, so... That's probably what the dungeon item is. So I can't really think of anything else it could be. Wait. Wait. Oh wait, no, never mind, I can't get the treasure chest I was thinking of. Wait a minute. Okay, never mind, I can't. Actually... Yeah, never mind, I can't go there. But there's a treasure chest. Oh wait, no, never mind. I cannot read maps, apparently. My, my one weakness, I can't read a map. Okay, so the locked door was over to this side. I'm... okay then. I was, I was stuck for a second there. Okay, let's just swing like a madman. And boom! Okay, I can finally open this. Uh, um... Okay then. Ha! Okay, so... Following that owl and statue advice thing, we're going straight into the eye here. Oh, hello. Um... Didn't we face something like this before? I'm pretty sure we have. Um... Okay. Yes, that's how you do it. Just I'm having trouble picking the thing up for some reason. Okay, get your... No! It's like we're playing dodgeball. Okay, get your butt over. Really? Oh my god, this is... Really? I, I pressed the button. This... whatever this thing is. Here, have your... have your ball back. Really? Now you're dead. Give me the fairy. And another fairy? Okay then, I'll take it. Um... I wonder. 
No, so why give me the bombs? Whatever. Wait, what? What? Um... Unless... There's a... Is there an opening here? confused here. Also, that. Is there really nothing here? There's a thing hidden under here. But how... How do I move it? Really? <sighs> of course. Of course it is. Okay, first off. Anything? Like there's nothing. Oh, hello. Okay, that is a scary thing. That's another scary thing. I like how when you jump on Goombas, they always give you hearts.
really? Okay, so... First off, let's get rid of the Moldorm. And then... Let's... Get rid of these dudes. Just like that. Two for the price of one. Get out of my face. Where are we anyways? Okay. And we got a more powerful bracelet. The powerful bracelet. Okay then. So I'm guessing I can actually lift these up now. And I get a fairy out of it. Okay, cool. Okay. Actually, that means I can go grab the thing there. Let's go put the bomb in my slot. And I'm gonna quickly grab that treasure chest in the top left corner. Who knows, it might be like the nightmare key or something. Um, I don't think I need to hit that. I'm gonna grab this, because it's gonna put me back at full health, which means... The greatest thing of all... Sword beams. Aha! I figured out the secret. Okay, so I can do that. Oh, hello. And then, with that... Boom. Oh. Okay then. You got 100 rupees. You're happy. What is this? Um. Uh. What is this? Whatever. What's up here? 20 rupees. Okay then. Well, we're back in the face shrine. Uh. Was I gypped? What is this? Why does it keep on giving me the error noise? Okay then, I'll, I'll take it. Uh, where... There's my bow. I wanted to hit that thing. Okay, so now I can actually leave. Well, not leave the dungeon, but... Go back to where I was. Also grab that treasure chest that's there. That's not the power... That's not the rock's feather, not the power feather, as I was gonna say. I'll take the piece of power. I wonder, does the piece of power affect the strength of my sword beams? Uh, that's an important question worth asking. So, right over here... You know what, let's... Do that. And... Boom. Nope. 100 rupees. I'll take it. We're almost up to... 
to maximum wallet capacity. Which is a very strange way of saying my wallet is almost full. Okay, so let's hop in here because it's a shortcut. Or not. Okay. Boom. Uh, okay. Let's think. Boom, boom. Oop. Gotta be careful. Wait till you pop up. And then focus on killing you. See, if I do it one at a time, it makes it easier. But I can also get both of them right now. Just like that. Don't even need to worry about... Um... Wasting my arrows here. Oh, this is... This is a puzzle if I've ever seen one. Um... Sword and you... Okay, what do you say? Hop on top of the crystals to move forward. Am I stuck? No, I'm not. Okay. Actually, hold up. Hop on top of the crystals? I can't even do that. Okay, I lost the piece of power, but that's that's of no concern to me, actually. Wait, I have the rocks fed. I can jump over that. Okay, there's a key there that I need. Oh, I wonder, is this the key? Yep. Okay, so... Two more treasure chests left in this dungeon. Wait, there's a key in this room, which I can't get, so I know what... I know what one of the treasure chests are. Okay, what I need to do... Is... Maybe... Maybe this will work. Okay, never mind, that didn't work. My master plan did not work. Um... Okay, so I guess I have to hit a crystal switch here? Um... Okay, did not mean to walk into that. So the nearest crystal switch is like right... In this room? Okay, no. It's a bit further up. Right over there. Then I can go back to where I was heading. I'll take the heart. And this should work. Yeah, right over here. I love the noise it makes when you throw these elephant statues. Have to kill these things again. Ha! Ah, two for the price of one. Advanced hookshotting tactics. Just like that. Did not mean to set a bomb there. Or... Sword. Ah, I see. 
just like that. Oh, we got a secret medicine. We should apply this and see what happens. Well, I already had one, so... Not sure what good that's gonna do. Okay, so let's see... How do I get there? That's the thing. Unless there's, like, a bombable wall here? Um... No. Oh, wait a minute! Okay. I see where I'm supposed to go. And dang, this episode is gonna be another long one, but... These dungeons have been getting fairly complex, so... Eh, it's whatever. Okay, let's take the shortcut here. Okay, warp me up, Scotty. Okay, so... I have quite a ways to go. I have to head up there. I'll take the heart. Okay, so my plan is... I can't really show you, but I'm gonna be going to that room that's to the left of where the boss room is, because there's a way down that I haven't been yet, and I have a feeling it's the way I'm supposed to be going, since I haven't explored that area yet. Okay, boom. Also, I do like how the level 2 bracelet is red. I don't know. I mean, it doesn't match the blue tunic, but... Whatever, we can't all... We can't always get what we want here. Okay, so... I'm going this way. Or I'm going this way. Yep. This this looks this looks right. Still don't know what that thing is. Wait, what? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I've... I remember. I just remembered. How... how did I miss this? Okay, it's in this room. Right over here. I can't believe I forgot that. Wait, give me this. Okay, so... Climb up. Okay, then. I'm guessing the key is gonna show up after I do all of this nonsense. Also, I need to figure out where I am. Okay, so that's where I am. 
Okay, first off, open you. Actually, no, I'm gonna head back. Because, what's down here? Oh, wait a minute, I can probably shoot that. No. Oh, are there... Yep, there's enemies here. That wasn't even fair. Um... Okay then. And boom. I wonder. Will this open up anything? Yes, well, it didn't open up anything, but I got a piece of power out of all this. And a fairy. Which I will gladly take. Oh, did not mean to. Okay, hurry up. Did not mean to fall to my death there. Okay, let's head back. Except, not really. I need to have all of these slimes fall to their deaths. Or, alternatively, fall to my death. Oh, I hit the... The eyeball thing. Okay. Well... Either way, I'm fairly confident that I know where to go now, so let's do this. Did not mean to do that. That was just a force of habit. Okay, lift you up. And then throw this. Okay, am I going to be stuck here? Oh, okay then, I guess I did it. Not really sure what that was for, but... Whatever. Oh, you know what? Duh. Just like that. Hey, these things, um, you kill them with arrows. Because that's how you kill them in Zelda 1, unless you're playing the Japanese version where you kill them with a microphone. Where am I going? Um, sure, let's go... Really? Um, how about no? Let's check out what's over here. I don't need my sword, so I'll just equip you. I trapped myself. Good going, Ralph. You're good at this game. Nope, leave me alone.
and boom. Ooh, arrows. I'll take that, and I'll take the heart as well. I'll take that. This is probably the boss key. No, it's 200 rupees. Okay, then. That, that worked. Okay, I guess I have to fight those things. Let's see. Do this song and dance again. And boom. Okay, I guess I have to bomb some not the dongos. Well, at least I have like a bajillion bombs now. And these things, like, make no effort to attack me. So, I, I feel kind of bad that I'm blowing them up, but not really. Come on. Boom. So this one requires two more hits. Right? Come on. Come on, nice juicy blue link here for you. Come on, you know you want to eat the link. I'm burning through my bombs here pretty fast. Oh well. Okay, I, I don't know where I got that last key from. But, I'll take it. So this should take me to the boss key, right? Also, I wonder what the hint here is, because we're pretty much done with the dungeon as it is. But nothing wrong in checking, right? To open a treasure chest, use the pots around it. Okay then. So how... Uh, I have to travel quite a bit, don't I? Actually, no, I don't. I can just go down here. And the way forward should be revealed to me. Really? I have to kill these things again? Things are annoying. It's not even like they're much of a threat, they're just annoying. Is this the one? Is this the room? No, it's the next one. Let's grab you. And this should take me straight. Well, not straight to the boss, but pretty close. Did not mean to do that. Let's get the Rock's Feather out. That's the Pegasus Boots. I can navigate the menu. Come on. Come on, Link. Link. That's better. And this should take us straight to the boss's room, almost. Except, have to worry about these things. It sure would be handy if I got, like, a fairy or something. All I have to do is just worry about this one whiz robe. 
Just like that. Wow, I'm taking a lot of damage right before the boss. Okay, well, will these give me the things again? Hopefully. Because I could do with some health. Yep. Okay, boss time. I'm probably gonna need this. Hey, it's the boogie tent. Hey, dummy, need a hint? My weak point is... Whoops, there I go, talking too much again. Um... Okay, then. Guess I just have to bide my time until these things go away. Oh, makes the pots move, too. Um... No. So what do I do? Did I hit him? I think I hit him. I, I think I'm doing damage. Yeah, I think I'm doing damage. Okay, listen up. If the windfish wakes up, everything on this island will be gone forever. And I do mean everything. Eerie. I mean, that is confirming what we found out in the Southern Face Shrine. And that's not a thing I want to imagine right now. So let's go claim our instrument, which is a triangle. You've got the coral triangle. Something calls from the mountains. Well. Whew. This was a long one. But we completed the sixth dungeon. So. I'm going to end it off here. Next episode. We're going to find out how to get into the seventh dungeon. Which we've already seen the entrance to. So. Yeah. We'll do that next episode. So. Later.